At the end of round four, St. Mary's Seminary Senior High School, Lolobi, had 13 points. <clears throat> At Bishop Porter Girls Senior High School, had 26 points. And Drobo Senior High School had 33 points. So we move to round five, which is the riddles round. In this round, I'll be reading a set of clues to a specific answer. And contestants, you can draw my attention by ringing your bells. Okay, let's hear your bell. St. Mary's Seminary, Drobo Senior High, Archbishop Porter Girl Senior High. Okay, so it's all working. So if you draw my attention and you give the correct answer whilst I'm on the first clue, the school gets five points. When I'm on the second clue, the school gets four points. But any other number of clues from thereafter, the school gets what? Three points. We want to win some money. St. Mary's, you ready? Drobo Senior High, are you ready? Archbishop Porter Girls, are you ready? My first riddle. I am a polygon. The sum of my interior angles is equal to the sum of my ex. St. Mary's. Yes. You are. A quadrilateral. That is not correct. Should I continue? Okay. The sum of my interior angles is equal to the sum of my exterior angles. I am formed by truncating an isosceles triangle parallel to its base. I have two pairs of congruent base angles. I have a pair of parallel sides. Act Bishop Porter girls. Isosceles trapezium. That is correct. <laughs> I am a particle. I am emitted in certain photon St. Mary's Seminary. You are alpha particle. That is not correct. <laughs> I am emitted in certain photon induced atomic phenomena. I am charged. My loss from a neutral atom produces a particle that is electrically repulsive to protons. I am the constituent of a neutral atom with the smallest mass. Who am I? Archbishop Porter Girls. You ring the bell, your answer should be ready. Okay. Drobo Senior High School. Citro. Port Citro. That is not correct. Okay, now you can give your answer. Proton. No. Does anyone know? From the audience? Hmm. An electron. When you ring the bell, your answer should be ready. You know all this. Ah. My third riddle, I can represent a wide array of biological units from individual organisms to individual ne neurons in the brain. In general, I am a localized swelling, that is a knot, or a point of intersection that St. Mary's ganglion. No. Or a point of intersection, which is a vertex. To the computer scientist, I'm a basic unit of a data or data structure. In physics, 
I am a point along a standing wave. Archbishop Potter Girls. Note. And that is correct. The last riddle. I am an aromatic terpin and a ketone with strong aroma. I am found in the back and wood of a tree commonly found in Asia. In homes, I am commonly used as an insect repellent. I am also applied in creams and ornaments to relieve pain and skin irritation. I sublime slowly at room temperature. Who am I? Archbishop Potter Girls. Naphtalin. That is not correct. else knows oh no one okay I'll give the answer it is 177 trimethyl bicyclo 2 2 2 1 heptane 2 on but we all we all know it as camphor and that ends round five So I have a petition here, and it's asking about the last riddle that um, my answer come for. Is it, is, are you saying it's the same as naphtalene? Oh no. Naphtalene is totally different from camphor. That is why I even began by giving the IOPAC name. Naphtalene is the combination of two phenyl rings mixed like fused together that's two phenyl rings fused together camphor as i mentioned it has a ketone in it it has a seven membered ring the structures are even different <laughs> naphtalene doesn't even have a ketone camphor has a ketone they are sources of of uh, derivation where they are from they are different naphtalene is from petroleum camphor is from plants so please this is a small education, okay? Thank you. So, at the end of the contest, here are the results. St. Mary's Seminary SHS Lolobi had 13 points. Archbishop Porter Girls Senior High School had 32 points. And Drobo Senior High School had 33 points. St. Mary's Seminary and